It was my great privilege uh, to know, know Dr. Cody. I came here in the uh, Christmas season, 1949, and there was nobody on campus, no students, and very few priests. And Dr. Cody was here, and um, he heard I was from America. I was a transfer student from Seton Hall in New Jersey, and um, he went for walks every day, and he wanted somebody to walk with, so he took my arm, and out we went. He with his cane, and he was a giant man. Uh, but I have a long stride, I'm a walker. And, and he said, uh, good Lord, Governor, would you please slow down? You have a long stride for a little man. <laughs> and that was, that was uh, Cody. Uh, he was uh, intrigued with America, but his concept came from the notion of justice. He, was a, he, was, he had a burning sense of justice, uh, the biblical sense of justice. He and Father Jimmy Tompkins did the cooperative movement in Nova Scotia. If he could see uh, the worldwide impact of the Antigonish movement, uh, he'd be, I, by the way, he would not be overwhelmed because he, he, he was such a big thinker that he would say, oh, then it's right and just, and they did it, and they should have done it, and so, great. But he would not be bowled over. He would be thrilled, but, but uh, he was Superman.